match results. Do stay tuned to see how this went down. Hey YouTube, Lil here, and I'm just gonna do the second half of this video because I figure it's probably gonna go up in two halves because I'm kinda lazy right now. So, my hair is in a threaded style, as you can see. This is probably not the same threaded style as the first video, but yeah, you know, probably like three weeks after or something um, in a different style. This style has been in currently for two weeks because I was only meant to have it in the first long. week. After like a f three or four days, I took it down and redid it so that it will restretch it a bit longer. And then I just kind of rocked it for a week and a half after because I couldn't be bothered to take it down. I might as well take it down on video so that you can see how I do it. There's two ways. So I'm probably going to talk over this now. All right, on to the first method. So this I call top down, which is basically unraveling the knot from the top of your stretch style. And if you haven't had it in for one and a half weeks like I have, it would be even easier. But basically once you unravel the knot a little, it loosens the rest of the thread further down and I just slide it down. Then when I get to the ends, I gently remove it from the bottom knot. Simple. Method two is the bottom up approach where I start with the knot at the bottom and I just gently twist the hair in the opposite direction to the thread and gently remove it from the knot. And then I just start to unravel the hair and it becomes quite simple really. Very self-explanatory but it's very important to be very gentle at both ends first at the knot at the bottom and then as you get to the top just to make sure you're not snagging any hairs at the root. And then once all the sections are done I put them in two buns and I took one down and added a moisturizer. This is one of my coconut detangling moisturizers that I made at home and I just um, avoid using any sprays of water to prevent any further shrinkage and uh, which would you know negate the whole process. The finger detangling portion was sped up here because it was actually the longest part but yeah I finger detangled this side of my head and then I put it in bantu knots. So as you can see the finger detangling is the longest part of this whole process but eh, what do you gotta do? Uh, my hair always for some reason feels very dry after I finish um, threading it even if I only live the thread in for a couple of days I do not know why but yeah my hair always feels ridiculously dry. If you have um, some way of getting past this please let me know in the comment section. In the meantime at least I have fierce big hair which I really enjoyed wearing out by itself but yeah it's getting to winter again and I can't wait for a protective styling time well that was me thanks for watching so if you found this video helpful do press the like button do comment do rate do share and do subscribe for more videos thanks for watching and God bless don't forget to check out my Instagram at Lola's Girls Official for the giveaways that are going on. See you guys there.